Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Crystallis. I did quite a bit of level grinding because I wanted to, um, yeah, I wanted to be as powerful as I could right here. Now I had read that if you use a shielding right here, these won't hurt you, so I'm going to try it out. Yeah, they're lying. Barrier's the way to go. Yes, you need to go to Shiren, you can't do anything else here. Yeah, and you may have noticed I didn't have a town on there. That's because whenever I was replaying, yeah, I didn't have, I didn't go back to Nadine. Yeah, I hate this part of the game because everyone dies. Yeah, so you want to go ahead and get sort of water and the blizzard bracelet, blizzard bracelet equipped. And just remember what Akahana said. Make sure we visit someone later. Okay. So we're now going to be fighting the number three sorcerer. He's kind of... He's just like... It's just like a giant pinball. But, you know, he'll do this pattern. Make sure whenever he stops, you just go ahead and release that. Because then that way you can get a good three or four hits. Yep, there we go. And he already have the ball of thunder. Wow. Yeah, go back to Goa, and now we can finally invade the Dragovian. Dragonian, I don't know why I keep saying Dragovian. Must have Dragon Quest 8 on the brain or something. Let's get out of my way. Yeah, you want to go ahead and just... Don't talk to anyone. And use your barrier spell, and just like, uh, head back up to that barrier that was here before. And there we go, we can defeat that now. Okay. This section's another kinda blind area. It's like I said, I have beaten this game many times, but see you need to go up on those platforms. And um run around the stage, but I can't remember exactly which one it is. I think it might be this one. If it's not, I'm just gonna, there's just going to be a lot of edits, so, yep, wrong way. I want to say this might be the right one, too. Yeah, that was the wrong way, too. This has to be the right way, because it's, it's one of the top left ones. I, I just remember. Ow. And it's been a while, but I'm pretty sure those ninja guys will poison you. Yeah, here we go. And we're going to go ahead and just equip the tornado bracelet and everything, because this is where we actually kill these guys. And I found him a lot easier this time around. Just because he doesn't stomp him for everything across the stage. You just have to worry more about his sword. Ooh, yeah, we're... Oh, crap, we're getting close to dying. Yeah, he's almost dead, and we're almost dead, too, so... But what do you expect? We're actually killing these guys, finally. And don't worry about, you know, it, go all out. You just don't worry about conserving amp, mana or anything, because right after this, every fiend of these we kill, we get, um, we get to see a wise man, and they heal us completely. Okay, something useful that I've discovered, this is the only room in this area where you can save. So it's good to save here. But let us see. This is yet another area where you need to make those. I don't know if that was the right way. Because I've, I've kind of noticed some things 
most of the time in these dungeons you want to go up and to the left, or up and to the right, then you'll finally, like, then you'll finally get in the right area. I want to say this isn't the right way, but, yeah, through the power. Those are always good. We need to replenish magic several times during these bosses. Ow. But yes, while I was training, I actually went into Mount Hydra, and I, well, as you see, I gained up quite a bit. I mean, gained several levels, because we need to be at least, at least level 14 to finish this area. And I like to go ahead and just finish it in one go, as opposed to just going everywhere. Okay, yeah, I lied. This was the right way we need to go. Yeah, this is probably, you want to just keep the, um, well, sort of water equipped. I think I just went in a big circle. Yeah, I did. That's great. Ugh, boy, I'm a loser. Let's see. I'm just going the wrong way now. I'm sorry, guys. I wasn't as prepared as I usually am. It was that that month of replaying this game, that's what got me. Not really. But the thing about these is the areas, I mean, you can only get lost so much in these areas, you can't You know, it's it's not a labyrinth or anything. Okay, now this fruit of rapoon we just got. Oh, what is it? Later if we um get turned into like a little we get turned into a slime or something by one of the later bosses. That will change us back. So yes, it is advisable to get that. Mm, excuse me, I just burped. <laughs> See, I don't know if we need to go into that. Make that walkway over there, but I'm sure we need to, need to make that one. I, like I said, I'm sorry guys, I can't, I just can't remember. This is probably one of, this is probably like the right area to go, because as you see, everything's going to kill me. And there was a barrier. Let's see. Was this it? Yes, this was it. Okay, now this one is going to be Sabera, so, you know, sort of fire again. And we actually kill her. She hasn't changed much. She only has one more attack. But you know, if you just keep your attacks going, you don't have to worry about it. Yeah, wow, that's <laughs> so much stuff on this screen. Yeah, there we go. Her other attack is like she shoots out a spider web and it, um. Oh, I have too many items. Her other attack is a. She shoots, like I said, she shoots out a spider web. And, um, it, you can't use your sword, and it just sucks up your, um, your MP, so it kind of sucks, but, yeah, what can you do? Okay, so, huzzah. Well, since we finished two of the, the demon lord evil sorcerers, I can't, I can't ever remember what they're called, the sorcerers, I'm gonna go ahead and call this video quits. So, next time I'm going to be finishing up the Dragonian. Yes, the Dragonian. Wait, Dragovian? Whatever. I'm going to be finishing up this castle. Bye, guys.